The day that went missing is about the death of my brother Nicholas, who was nine uh, on a family holiday in Cornwall when he drowned in the sea. I was 11 and I was in the water with him when he died. And after that time, we never talked about his death as a family. So the book is about trying to recover what actually happened, which had been lost to us, uh, and also how we had each dealt with it um, as individuals within the family. And it's called The Day That Went Missing, because it truly go missing. We had no idea what had happened. We'd all created different stories around this event. So I went to see how much of a single day could be recovered. And in this case, I could go back to documents, I could go to press reports from the time, um, and I could talk to people who were there, including, for example, the lifeboatmen who were in the lifeboat, which tried to rescue Nicky uh, on, uh, on the site at the beach in Cornwall. I also talked to my family. They all had their own memories of the day, but because we'd never talked about it, those memories had all evolved differently. And when we put them together, we had to try and find and try and agree on what was the accurate story. And one way to do that was to compare it to the documentary evidence. And I think we did eventually come to an agreement of what was most likely to have happened on that day. I don't think at the end of the book it's a simple case of uh, having a cathartic reaction to the book and the, the death has been resolved, uh, the mystery of the death has been resolved, and therefore um, the period of grief is over. I think it's slightly more complicated than that, and I would like to leave the reader with the feeling that grief needs attention, and to deny a death, to try and avoid the pain of grief, in the long run, will end up being more damaging than not. And I also hope at the end that the reader feels that I have resurrected Nicky to a certain extent, because in denying his death, we actually denied him and I hope that I have brought him back to life. Mm -hmm.